Fun fact, whenever there's an earthquake, coffins temporarily become maracas. And that's a true fact, that's a true statement. But this is indeed a true fact, I actually read this back in uh, 06. <laughs> he wrote this down in my textbooks, that coffins become maracas when there's earthquakes. You learn that in history class, baby. Historically, coffins are just nature's own maraca. <laughs> What's up guys and welcome back to MK. My name is Damien and today we're looking through r slash cursed comments. A blessed for- I went- Wow, oh, this is cute. I like- I couldn't even like read it the way because I'm like looking at the two little- What are these? Are these little- What animals are these? These aren't like hamsters, are they? They're too- They look too long to be hamsters. But I want what they have. Look at them. They're cuddled up. They're having a great night. I don't know how they're sharing the wheel. I wonder who was on it first. I think the guy laying down was on it first. He was- He's got this look of defeat but contentness, and I love it. Okay, so now spin it and go for a double kill. And you had to ruin it? It's not gonna be a double kill even. They both know how to run on the wheel. You just wanted to say something mean. <laughs> I didn't like that at all. You know, I have a Garfield onesie, and I'm kind of vibing with the Garfield couch. Sit on me, John. I'm not vibing with that statement. Is that the remote, or are you just happy to see me? Hopefully you brought some lasagna, John. <laughs> Sit on me, John. That's just a phrase you never want to have to say, especially to anyone named John. Sorry to the Johns out there, but if that's just a not a not a good phrase. <laughs> He donated blood every week for 60 years and saved the lives of 2.4 million babies. Because that's what heroes do. 2.4 million people had a positive HIV test. Because that's what villains do. And make no mistake, that man was a villain. <laughs> make no mistake, he was rotten to the core like a bad piece of fruit. Nah, I'm sure he was a good guy. Donating all that blood for 60 years too. Wait, wouldn't you run out of blood though? How much blood did he have by the end of it? Don't you run out of blood? Oh no. Oven baked versus Kraft macaroni and cheese. Oh, either way, I'm banging my macaroni. <laughs> macaroni with pieces of wiener in it. <laughs> hey, uh, how many of y'all have tried your own nut? Goes for both genders. I've tried my own nut and it tastes like nothing. That was long ago though. Well, you see a good chef always tastes what he prepares for others. That's why I do it every single time. Not me, the chef, John Rainbow X. Fun fact, the results would be similar if it was an actual cat. More messy, but similar. I mean, I mean, yeah, you're right, but at the same time, you're wrong. Like, I get what you're saying and I understand it, but you would that, that would imply that you have a, a hole on the cat's skull, and I don't think you'd do that, Chief. Brad, well, no, your name's, your name's Brad Brace. There's nothing you won't do, is there? Bradley Bracely. Hey, uh, what do guys do with sleepovers? <laughs> Easy, we sacrifice the weakest friend to the devil, and he becomes stronger. <laughs> it's time to sacrifice Bobby to the Satan circle, come back ten times stronger, then you're the real alpha. Go on, trade your soul for pecs. My grandma with an interesting start on the day. Marijuana, pros, giggle for a bit, cons, high blood pressure, risk of stroke, <laughs> homosexualness, overeating, murderous urges. Incest, loss of faith, devil horseship, masturbation. Wait, you guys need to smoke weed to get the cons? Pfft, that just sounds like a regular day to me. Ah, uh, yeah, see, it's funny. Ah, uh ha. -huh. Ah, uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> 100 year old self playing violin. That's cool. The eighth wonder of the world. That's cool as hell. Oh, okay, okay. So when a violin plays itself, it's called an eighth wonder of the world. But when I play with myself, I get thrown out from the museum? <laughs> Double standards these days, are you kidding me? Why can't I be a wonder of the world? Especially when I do what I call the tweezer teaser. <laughs> <laughs> you can go ahead and just think about what that means. Vsauce should be person of the year. Why can we eat apples, but not 12 year olds? <laughs> Years since dad left, 32. <laughs> This is stupid. You can eat 12 year olds. Do you have evidence? Proof? For the court, maybe speak directly into the mic, sir. Every time you take a poo, a poor kid in Africa gets free food. And that's a god tier superpower. <sighs> Guess I'm not pooping anymore. Well, aren't you a Scrooge? Huh, so that's why Mark disappeared. I once sold a kid in school. Wait, told. Wait, no, 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 no. Ah. Uh. There are no accidents. Somebody once sold me a creep is gonna own me. Please come help, I'm locked up in his shed. <laughs> oh, I love it when a community comes together for something truly cursed. It's like being hexed. 
Oh, Garfield, John moaned. Please be gentle with my little small body. Open wide, Jonathan. Get ready for my meanie lasagna. Garfield's booming voice com commanded. <laughs> Not just said, it was spoken like a command. Oh, Garfield. I'm wearing, I'm wearing my Garfield onesie right now and I feel dirty in it. This makes me feel filthy. Please stop asking for my bath water. I take showers. Is used mouthwash an option? What about used tampons? <sighs> I'd love to freeze them and then... <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> I'd love to freeze them, then suckle the blood out. Don't say that, man. Come on, don't, don't, don't say that. Why would you say these words? Yucky, 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 yucky. Ah, <sighs> not a cell phone on sight, just people living in the moment. I've seen this meme a bunch and I don't know what game it comes from. If anyone is smart and has played this game and can tell me where it's from, why is this a scene in it? Is this important to the story? Is this a campaign? Is this just like a, like, what's the, what's the exacts here? I don't know this game. Please and thank you. Can't spell disconnected from society without disco. Bow, chicka, bow, bow, chicka, bow, chicka, bow, chicka, bow. Huh, can't spell manslaughter without laughter. Can't spell assassin without a, oh, I get it. I get it, he died. <laughs> <laughs> Probably from assassination. Do you ever just look at your hand and wonder, how does this thing work? Oh, Ricky. Every single day. Come on, man. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You, you just wanted to sleep together? Oh, my heart is so hard right now. Actually, your heart is constantly fapping to send blood throughout your body. Just thought you'd want to know. I didn't, but thanks. <gasps> oh my God, he's just vibing. He's just chilling in the roof. I already know that someone's gonna make a, a, a griller, like a, a, a grill roller joke. Uh, that is what chilling means. Oh, yep, there it is, rotating calmly inside the gas station hot dog heater. I knew it was coming, and why am I still sad about it? <laughs> if you feed a moose, it may become aggressive and attack the next human it meets if it has no food to offer. Huh. Feeding a moose is my favorite hobby now. The entire country of Canada is in danger, for I have a bucket of food and no care in the world. It's moose feeding season, baby. <laughs> Delicious. Durex, garlic bread flavor for her pleasure. Why is this in spubby? This isn't a spubby. Oh, hard cut to me opening my lunch and pulling out 15 garlic bread condoms to suckle on. <laughs> Just imagine you work at an office, it's lunch break, you all go down to the to the lunch area. He's sitting across from you, opens up his brown bag lunch. You turn back to eat your sandwich, you just hear You look to your right. He's suckling on condoms, and you're like, Richard? And he goes, Hoom? mouthful of condom. And he offers you one and goes, they're garlic bread flavored. Do you accept with enthusiasm or with grace? There is a correct answer and it will be on the test. Whoa, what? In 1965, a machine was patented to deliver a baby using centrifugal force. The machine would spin you until the baby came out and it would be caught in a net. <laughs> <laughs> you spin me right round, baby right round. I mean, technically, but you spin the baby right round, baby right round. So does it have to spin fast then? Because I could only assume that this would entail that the baby is just, that you're just zooming. I feel like that would be oddly more painful. This just, <laughs> I guess there's a reason we don't see this anymore, huh? Blurst, Star Wars. This is blessed, what do you mean? But wait, aren't they supposed to get inside that? Oh, it is blurst, isn't it? Hey, what's the definition of trust? Easy, two cannibals giving each other blowjobs. You can thank me later for this definition of trust. When you walk in on a cowgirl showering and she's not censored by steam. No, oh, I'll never forgive the Japanese. Well, actually, I pixelated my penis to stay here until marriage. But now I don't know how to get rid of it. At first I thought it was kind of neat, and now I'm scared. It's been three years. <laughs> Y'all ever think about how your fingers are slowly 3D printing your nails? No, and don't ever ask me again about that. I like to think that my butthole 3D prints sausages. So sausages? Is that what you call your, your stinky turds, chief? To each their own. Sausages. Do you call your toilet the, the watery grill? Why sausages? What is the point? I don't like that you call them that. Sausages have a different, like, con consistency entirely. Mmm. Makes me feel weird. Hey, does each dog come with a stuffed animal they can accidentally kill by hugging too hard? <gasps> oh, no. I just looked at the dolls. Come on, man. <laughs> That's awful. <laughs> Holy hell. Yeah, holy hell is right because that's just that's dark. That was like genuinely dark. This is a good cursed comment. It made me sad too. Hey, what car do you have? Red with a horse? Ferrari? Nah. <laughs> nah, it's red and a horse is in the back. 
I mean, hey, it's gonna make car sex fun at least. Get out of the car. <laughs> <laughs> Get out of the car right now. My pocket teaching my headphones how to tie themselves. The monkey chain. Damn, dude, imagine your headphones turning into a noose and strangling you. I'd like to see them try. I got AirPods. Doctor, don't worry. Vladimir Pudding isn't real. He can't hurt you. Vladimir Pudding. I'm laying in your pudding. It's me, Vladimir Pudding. Mm, yes, fill up my tummy, Vladimir, with your dreamy... Did you call pudding a sauce? I like to give it more as a custard, thank you very much. Never call pudding a sauce. Sauce is very, it has a different kind of consistency than, than pudding. Pudding is not a sauce. I'm just mad by the, uh, this is making, this, this is making my, my, my body act up. Like I'm reacting physically to this, I burped. Ugh. Next time you call putting a sauce, I'm gonna turn you into sauce. Grind up your stupid bones and turn it into a sauce for my sandwiches. So, true story. I'm a maternity nurse, so I see naked ladies like it's my job. Is it your job? But rarely see naked men, other than my husband. So we're watching Westworld and I hardly notice the ladies, but every time I see a penis, I'm like, oh my god, penis. But every time I see a penis, I'm like, oh my god, penis. Check your inbox. Ah ha ha. Fun fact. The side of Mercury facing the sun is extremely hot, while the far side is extremely cold, but the rotation is very slow. So you could jog along the equator on the edge of dusk in Earth-like temperatures forever. Slow down, you burn. Run too fast, you freeze. Huh, this is a new prison system for the US. That'll teach them crooks. Send them to Mercury. It's too bad milk doesn't stain your teeth white, cause that would be convenient. Yeah, it would be convenient. Upvoted. But it wouldn't be as good if it stained your entire mouth white. Oh well. I will drink enough milk to make my mouth blind anyone who peers into it. Then move to a mountain and promise anyone who looks into my mouth endless treasures. It will be a lesson on greed. It was the whitest white any of us had ever seen. Then it was the blackest black forever. This is a medieval villain. <laughs> this is a warlock bent on destruction. I worked at a McDonald's for two and a half years and I put 11 nuggets on almost every 10 piece I made. When I worked at Chevron, I never let anyone pay for gas. I'd see them about to put in their cart and say, you're good boss, gas is free today. In my two years of employment, I gave away over $1 million in free gasoline. I worked at McDonald's for two and a half years and I put my wiener on almost every milkshake I made and I stirred. <laughs> Imagine that he was the manager too. That's why no one caught him. He was the manager, he'd take him into his office and go, excuse me, I, have to, I need to see this, inspect it. He'd just drop trow and stick his disgusting shrimpy in. Vanilla milkshake, none the wiser. Chocolate milkshake, better hope it's deep in the cup. Now to feature a post from user Small Toasty, a fan art of Damien on my Instagram, at Small French Toast. Okay, okay, I'll join Reddit, why not, ooh woo. And I seen this, he sent this to me. I loved this, I'm pretty sure I put it, I, I think I put this on my story, I'm pretty sure I did. I loved this, thank you so much. This is sick. And we also got your Instagram up on here, at Small French Toast, for those Instagram users, go ahead and give that a follow. And again, thank you so much for the fan art. You actually drew another piece that I liked as well, that I think is on your page and that's gonna do it for r slash cursed comments if you guys like the video leave a like down below and subscribe for more content from mk and if you want to catch more of damian lee you can find me at twitch.tv forward slash damian lee live and as always i'll be seeing you